Is the HPV vaccine really dangerous? Could it really cause infertility and serious long-term harm? Or is this just another classic social media myth? So recent global research just been delivered and this has been one of the clearest verdicts yet and it should settle this once and for all. So this is what we know. Um, it's a, a brand new pair of reviews drawing on more than 130 million vaccination records worldwide find that people vaccinated by the age of 16 are about 80% less likely to develop cervical cancer than those who are unvaccinated. That is a massive drop. In addition, HPV-related precancerous changes and genital warts also decline sharply after vaccination, especially when the jab happens before first exposure to the virus. So what about these scary rumours? Despite widespread concern online that HPV vaccines can cause infertility and serious long-term harm, the evidence just isn't showing that. The reviews found no link between credible, credible link between HPV vaccination and future fertility problems, no increase in serious adverse events and only minor short-lived side effects like a sore arm. So health authorities around the world, including the World Health Organization, agree. Meanwhile, HPV itself can cause fertility problems, not through the vaccine, but persistent infections sometimes lead to precancerous lesions or cervical cancer. And surgical treatments for those may affect fertility later. So getting vaccinated helps you avoid that risk. Yet vaccination rates have fallen. So before COVID-19 pandemic, uptake in many regions was high. But now in places, including in some places in the UK, the rates have dropped. So misinformation online, especially posts falsely linking the jab to infertility or long-term issues, is cited as a major reason for this. And that decline matters because fewer vaccinated people means less collective protection. So the bottom line is this. The HPV vaccine isn't just safe. It's one of the most effective tools we have against preventable cancers. So if you are a parent or a teenager and you're unsure, skip the social media. The science is clear. Get vaccinated if you can. And if you and then you can help protect not just yourself, but everyone around you. What do you think? Have you read the scary rumours online? Are you nervous about it? Or have I made you feel a bit more confident? Let me know what you think.